Hello everyone, welcome to Phasmophobia. Today, we're heading into Tanglewood on Nightmare. Now, I know last time I said we were going to prison, but I'm going to save that for the next two videos. Next two videos, we're going to go to prison, then high school and professional. But I wanted to go back to Tanglewood, and we're going to start doing the Nightmare games on the small maps again. So, I'm going to start going through the small maps again here on Nightmare. Now also, we have to escape and repel... Wait, escape daring and... Uh, yeah, well, so both those together, and then capture, so... Great objectives. But otherwise, I just wanted to spend some time on Tanglewood here before we go to some of the other bigger maps. Also, I'm gonna see how I do on Nightmare here. But yeah, I do want to spend... I just wanted to, like, get into a smaller map. I mean, I do think the farmhouses are small. Some people apparently say that the they feel like the small the farmhouses are pretty big, but I still think they're pretty small. Nothing like Point Hope. Which, Point Hope, next time we play Point Hope, I'll talk more about that. Well, I wanted, I looked for the tarot cards there. Oh, it looks like we have the mirror, so we're going to know where the ghost is. Now, I think I heard something as I was walking around, but I'm not sure. Now, again, I'm got to remember we're on Nightmare, so I don't want to waste my sanity. But let me make sure we have a hiding spot. Now, I don't know if they fixed this, but apparently you can hide like right here, which I actually did by accident one time, and I swear I had no idea you actually could survive. So I kind of consider that like a a cheap hiding spot but if they're not gonna uh, let's hope the locker in the garage is open because if it is then we're good is there any ghost here oh god more mannequins so i don't think i no tarot cards no let's go to the basement all right oh found the bone Oh yeah, it's the stupid mirror. Did I take a photo of that? Okay, I did. See, that's what happens. I find the thing and then I- or I find the cursed item and then I just kind of ignore it. Now look at this. This is like the one hiding spot. Okay, got the bone, got the mirror. Let's grab this. I just wanted to make sure I'm doing everything right here. Alright, ghost, where are you? Give us a sign. I know I can look at the mirror. Oh, the breaker. Did I walk right past the breaker? Yep, there we go. I was so focused on everything else. I usually kind of forget about the breaker on this map. Oh, okay. I'll take this. What I really should do... I'm going to go ahead and just drop my stuff. I'm going to go get the UV. I don't know if I'll have time for that. So the only hiding spot is the one in the basement. Like, every other hiding spot is now gone. So apparently, I'm going to have to loop the ghost here. So I'm going to leave my sanity as it was. I don't think it's too bad. Let's run back in there with this. Maybe see freezing and then, I don't know, look for ghost orbs, I guess. I really should go in there with like a smudge stick or something just to make sure I have the defenses. But otherwise, I don't know. I, I'm going to have to learn to loop on this map, I guess. And I've looped ghosts before, but not really on Nightmare. Well, you touched one door. Oh, you're touching all these doors. Thank you. Oh. Maybe I should determine what door that actually is. Alright. So, no fingerprints. We do have a general area of where this ghost is. Since I have this in my hand, let's look at the temperature. I know I just got the breaker on. It just touched the breaker door, by the way. Can I get a photo of this? Okay, look at that. We're doing good on photos, and we have the bone. Now, I don't know for sure still if you can get the fingerprints on here. God, that makes a crazy noise. But we didn't get fingerprints yet. Oops. Let me check again. Again, I, I know we just turned on the breaker, so it's probably not going to be too cold. This room seems to be getting cooler. Did I just hear something? I swear I just heard, like, maybe something get glitchy. I'm... I swear I'm just- ooh! Oh, maybe you actually are in this room and you're just roaming a little bit. I heard that door touch. No EMF-5. Is it- oh, it's actually this one. Okay, hmm. <laughs> More door photos. Alright, you really don't want to give that, but you know what though? The temperature is telling us this is your room. Well, now it's going back up. Hey. Okay. Maybe you're in here and you're just roaming? Oh my god, well, we're seeing lower temperatures still around this area. 
I think it's- oh my god, it's touching this. Mm, okay, eight in here now. I would say it's this room. More photos. No EMF5. Okay, still no EMF5. Okay. If, since we're doing this ghost, I need a photo of the ghost. So I can't fill in my book just yet. But if I could get one more photo, or at least I could stop worrying about photos this second. Oh my god. You know, attack me when I take my hand off the mouse. I don't- I'm gonna turn this light on. So since we don't know the room, I wanted to go off the temperatures. Okay, look. We have a full book of photos. So I still want that ghost photo, so I'm not gonna drop that just yet. But since I don't know the room, let me scan for ghost orbs in here. I don't like that I don't have a smudge, and I also don't like that I'm in the dark and just draining my sanity. So since I was feeling like this was the ghost room, I feel like this is a ghost that's roaming out of its main room. Okay, though, come on, with how much it's touching that, it has to be in the garage. I want to, like, turn off the breaker to see if it gets colder, but you're going to have to have the breaker on just to see what room is cold, I guess. Maybe if you got all the rooms cold, then turn the breaker on, it would warm up all the other rooms. But look, these rooms are staying warm. This one's cool. I'm saying it's actually garage now. I mean, if it touched this, that would help. But it's touched this so many times, we pretty much know this is the room. It just hasn't thrown anything like the caulk or anything. Oh yeah, look, the temperature's going down. I looked for orbs. Oh, there's that car. I'm gonna turn that right off. So, oh. I don't see the orbs. This is only EMF2. I want to put this somewhere I can remember it. So let's just go get more equipment. I want to turn these lights on though when I inevitably need to... Oh. There's that thing again here. Let me just see if that's EMF. I'm going to have to loop at some point though. And also this one... Oh no, it was this door. With all this touching though, I have not gotten EMF5, and I have not gotten any evidence yet, have I? I mean, freezing usually happens faster, especially if the ghost is in the room for that long. So it feels like it's not even freezing. Well, let me go get some other stuff. Well, this one's being a lot different than the last ghost. I mean, that's what happens on Nightmare. I didn't really have a lot of evidence in there, so let's get everything else that when the ghost wasn't giving me. This is looking good, though. Now, hmm, I want to get a smudge in there, so I'm going to go in with a smudge and I guess leave one of the evidence out here. I wish I could get all of them in here, but maybe it won't have writing as one of the two it's showing me. There's, I looked back here, didn't I? Yeah, there's no hiding spots. Is this one? No, man, there's nothing. If I had to, I guess I could try to hide there, but the only place is to go down into the basement, which works. But I hate to go down into the basement and then have to escape out of the house from the basement. Alright, well again, the door, or the ghost, has been going through the door, so I'll leave it in the intersection. I've been just using my headlight now on these small maps, so I'm not really going to pick up my other light. I'll just leave it there. Are you here? Are you friendly? Are you here? Are you friendly? Give us a sign. Are you here? Are you away? Are you far? Are you here? I just want to spam it. Where are you? Well, how stubborn is this one going to be? The problem is when you scan for everything and you just can't find anything. We're still close to freezing oh wow we're getting closer and closer oh my okay i think if it's 0.3 it is freezing see that's all right i'm going by what in sim says 0 0.02 or it was 0 0.2 there it is okay we know it's freezing god that took forever so hmm never got fingerprints or the uv we've not seen them go through dots 
I, this has to be the room though with it going down to freezing. What if like the ghost orbs were like in the car or something? Well, I'm starting to think maybe the other one, the other evidence is the book. Well, let's get the book in here. Maybe get some more smudges as well. If it was the book, what would we have? Revenant Shade. This seems like a shade. It's only been doing the same things. It really doesn't seem like a demon. And a Moroi, as we know, would have Spirit Box. And actually... Oh, I put, I put in Ghost Riding. Okay, now. So let's go see what we can find. Okay, I'm opting to bring in two more smudges, just for the safety. So now we have three smudges. I'm gonna put one out here. Keep the other one on me. No, please, let me turn this off. Now, I have a feeling that it is this book. I'm gonna put it... Oh my god. I'm gonna put the book right here. That covers most of this room. I'm gonna turn the light on. I have no idea how I'm doing sanity-wise. So another thing that makes me think this is a shade is uh, no ghost events or anything. I mean, I, eh, nothing's happened. Hmm. So we have the mirror, which really isn't going to do much for me, is it? Give us a sign. Let me use the ghost's name. Kim Doe, give us a sign. That'd be great if you showed yourself right now. I don't have a summoning circle for an easy ghost photo here. I only get one attempt, that's kind of like the thing. So I nearly need like to do this during a ghost event and not a hunt because I can't really spam the ghost photo. I have my other smudge there, I don't know if that's a good spot for it. See, I'm, and this feels like a shade. No writing, no nothing else. Let me see if it's still freezing in here. I know the ghost can change its room. You didn't write, okay. Are you here? Are you friendly? Where are you? Are you here? Are you friendly? Are you away? Are you here? Are you friendly? Okay, you really don't seem like Spirit Box. This could be just a shade that will not write. So, and maybe it, I'm, I'm hitting or staying in the dark here. So maybe the ghost will hunt, but guess what? If the shade's in here with me, it won't even hunt. So it might come down to me just having to drain my sanity intentionally. So I'm not worried about a super perfect game, I guess. Because unless the, this has to be a shade. I'm standing in the dark this whole time. It's a nightmare ghost and the ghost has done nothing. So, Okay, well, uh, you did something there, but all you can really do is throw a hammer. I do appreciate that, though. Okay. Let's put the uh, smudges here. I'm going to hit this. I'm going to drain my sanity, but we're not going to get a cursed hunt. Now, I feel like I'm in hunt range, and if the ghost hunts... From the same room, we know it's not a shade. But this has to be a shade, and it's just not interacting enough to do anything. I mean, the obvious one's here. We, we don't have spirit box. We don't even have writing. Okay, so since we have freezing, we know it's not Obake. And since we haven't seen freezing, or the fingerprints, we really know it's not showing the UV. The thing is, I can't get enough interact. Do something, Jane. Give us a sign. I haven't had enough EMF interactions. Well, I, at the beginning, we had all those door touches that didn't give me EMF 5. I think this is a shade. Look, this ghost is doing nothing. This is a shade. Jane. J who was this? Kim Doe. I think I was thinking of Jane Doe. Kim Doe. I feel like I have my spirit box or something. This is a shade. Okay. I'm going to get the other book in here. Maybe just the other smudge. What do I have on me? I'm going to drop this smudge. I'm going to go see what my sanity is. Now, please don't hunt as I'm running out. Well, I can't see my sanity. But the thing is, is I'm going to probably hit it, the mirror again and lower it. Let me get the other smudge in there. I'm going to get the other book in there. Now, the odds of this... Oh, you know what? I forgot. If you smudge, you get more activity. See, I got to remember that. 
So I'll use up one of these smudges to maybe get more activity. See, it does, that's how, shades always do this. Okay, not a revenant. Okay, I'm just gonna like loot. Is my, oh my God, I'm so dumb again. <laughs> Why are you doing this? Oh my God, what are we doing? I'm trying to block line of sight. <laughs> Uh, but it, yeah. mm. Turned into Porky Pig. Okay. I have one more smudge. This was supposed to be a short hunt, by the way. Okay. Well, after that, this was a shade. It hunted when I wasn't in the room. It's smudged now. <laughs> what did I do with that book? I have no idea what just happened. We ha Oh my god, we have all these smudges too, so. And we actually have this other one on the ground. I thought I was down to one smudge stick. So guess what? <laughs> we know it's not a revenant. Okay, yes, this ghost really did s screw me up. I'm gonna throw this other one in here. We have a few minutes now. The problem is, is like, I wanna like cover the whole room, but I mean, I doubt the ghost is gonna be back in that little corner. But the reason this is a shade, I mean, what would it be giving me? Ghost writing? We haven't gotten UV, which is not shade anyway. It could be hiding EMF5. So EMF5 and writing is shade. So <laughs> this is crazy. This is a nightmare for you. But we know it's not a revenant. So if it was writing, revenant, and demon, like it's not either of those. We haven't had one ghost event. Come on, this is a shade, obviously. I just want to get the ghost writing or the EMF5 to prove it. But with it being a shade, that's going to be impossible. Well, did we get the objectives? Yes. Now the only thing is the photo of the ghost. Oh, yeah, see, we're in the same room. Well, it could still be... I might just run to the basement and hide. I don't... Oh, it's writing! Finally! And now I'm in the same room with you. So you are a shade. You have to be. You want to know why? You're not a revenant. A demon would have hunted me a million times by now. And a moroi would have spirit box. So, oh my god, the longest shade in the world. Now, the problem is, is a shade will just pretty much not give me a ghost event. What I what I'm like to do, I'm gonna sit here. Oh god, this is just gonna be impossible. The eye adjustment's kind of weird too. Let me turn off my headlight. There we go. I'm not gonna get a photo here, but at least oh, <laughs> at least let me try to smudge. Oh my god. I've never really hidden down here. You seem faster, though. Why do you have to come down here? Maybe that's normal speed. I guess that's normal speed. I just gotta play the game more and one day I'll learn. I think that's normal speed, though. And guess what? Like, now that we got ghost riding and freezing... We pretty much know it's shade. Like, there's no way it couldn't be shade. So, alright, I'm gonna just go ahead and say, sorry, no photo of the ghost. But I will try and run in here. Oh, I have another smudge. But I, well, oh my god, I, I am losing track of everything. I'll grab a photo of that. But yes, okay, I did use the smudge that was on there somewhere. <laughs> I, got, I got really lost track of it. But alright, this is a good game. Let's see if this shade will let me leave. Okay, there we go. All right, look, this was a pretty thorough nightmare game. I'm gonna go ahead and end it here. I did die last time, so I wanna get it out with a win. So let's see how much money we made here. One of the biggest things that gives away the shade is that it never does a ghost event, and it never hunts in the same room as you. And every time it hunted there, I was not in the same room. So that one was pretty obvious now, look at that. Now, the only thing is, do we even have the money for it? Oh God, game, don't freeze on me. Oh God, game, don't freeze on me. Here we go, we're fine. Alright, I'll quickly go through this. I'm not really looking for anything, but I always show this off. Just because. Now let's go over to the store. And look at this. Oh, it's 3,000. <laughs> we have enough. I'm gonna go ahead and get it. Let's read this. SB11Z is a much larger spirit box capable of scanning two frequency channels at the same time. When turned on, this spirit box scans both frequencies, increasing the chance of picking up paranormal response when asked questions. Also has a built-in noise filter, reduced amount of static. Okay. Yeah, for every response... If a question is heard and no response is given, the red the response LEDs will flash red. 
If a reply is given, the LEDs will flash white in time with the sound. That was a long-winded explanation of something I pretty much already knew how to do. But audio quality high, response high, and range 5 meters, so finally we're getting to that tier 3 stuff. So next time, for the bigger maps, looks like we'll be able to use that. But I also need to remember to add that to the loadout. So there, tier 3 spirit box, so looks like next time we're going to be checking that out. But yeah, we're going to be going to prison and going to high school for the next few games and just kind of having fun on the bigger maps and as we get into halloween i'm not sure what's going to happen i'd like to play a lot more of the smaller maps professional and nightmare so that's why in september here i'm kind of just playing some of the bigger maps so if you're still here thank you so much for watching remember to like and subscribe and i will see you all next time